Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Janet Jackson. Congr- Hi. Hi. Congratulations on the new album. Thank you. Number one album, the tenth number one album. Congrats. Yes, thank you. But thank you for your support and thank all the fans for making it happen. Now, let me ask you a question. When you did this song, which I'm loving, feedback. Um, did you know you were doing classic Janet? Like, did you did you realize that, or were you you know? Were you just doing you, or did someone come to you and say, this is a hot song? No, the whole idea behind it all was to basically still do me, but just put a modern twist to it from the gate. So that's that's what I was after. You know, we miss that. And it, with all these little girls like Ciara and who else is trying to hop on stage and dance like you, it's so refreshing to actually get Miss Rhythm Nation herself back to show these little girls what it really is. How did you feel watching these other artists come out and pretty much jack Miss Jackson? Well, it's, it's, everyone gets this inspiration from somewhere. And, and like they say that the imitation is the best form of, of flattery. Exactly. So I, I it, honestly, it, it didn't bother me at all. And everyone, like I said, gets their inspiration from someone, something. So I, I was really flattered, I was. But you like friendly competition. Like, when you see these girls dancing, I know to yourself, you're like, you can't do it like me. I got to get these little <laughs> bitches. I know. Like, I got to come no, back. No, no. I, 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 I really enjoy them. I enjoy watching them. The little children <laughs> trying to be you. <laughs> <laughs> now, also, this, we're talking to Janet Jackson. Now, Janet, we're trying to get Miss Jones to go to the strip clubs. And you say every once in a while, you go to the strip club and you make it rain every once in a while. How can we get Jones to the strip clubs? I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's not for everyone. It is, it's just something that you're not interested in doing? Or? I just, I don't know. I feel uncomfortable. Like, well, I mean, there's, I oh, God, I sound so silly saying this, but you got to have some form of, of discipline, I suppose. Thank but you. you won't know until you try it. What? Well, well, all right, oh. then. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Janet, are you and Jermaine going to get married soon? We haven't talked about it. Everybody else has. Is <laughs> Everybody something? else has talked about it. We haven't. I don't know. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Now, when you first met Jermaine, like, we were shocked. You guys seem like total opposites in two different parts of the world, really. When you first bring him to the house to meet the family, how was that? When he first meets the Jackson family? We seem like opposites to everybody else. Because they didn't know either one of us. Mm. Jermaine and I are, are, are just alike. And that that's that's the... That's the thing people don't know. Um, it was great. My my family adores him. Mm-hmm. They really adore him. My mother is always asking about him when she doesn't see him. And well, my brothers and sisters. It's probably like you guys are married anyway without all the legalities. I'm sorry, say that again? Oh, I said it's probably like you guys are already married without the legalities. Well, well why would that be? Because we're what? Because of the bond being so strong and your family. Mm. Your, go ahead. No, 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 you're, you're absolutely right. There is a, there's a very strong bond between us. Right. And the strongest that I've, I've had in a relationship, I have to say. That's beautiful. And Miss Jackson, when you see somebody like Beyonce, whose dad... Oh, is, now you call her Miss Jackson. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I'm sorry. Miss Jackson. I had to say Miss Jackson. I had to say Miss Jackson. When you see Beyonce and how strong her father's influence on her career is, do you see like kind of a, a similarity on the point where she's going to have to break away from him the same way you had to break away from your father? Good question. Every, every situation is different. I could see where the inspiration came from. I could see uh, that part of it, that aspect of it. Every situation is different. Um, I don't know. I, I don't know their relationship. I, I think they're doing a very wonderful job together, and hopefully it, it, it won't happen. It doesn't happen with everyone. Do you have a lot of female friends, or do you have girlfriends? And if so, what do you guys do? What do you talk about when you talk? I, I have some girlfriends. I'm more partial to guys. I Growing up, being around a lot of boys, that, that was always my thing. Having a lot of brothers, being a tomboy. But I have a few, I have a few girlfriends. We talk about girl things. We talk about guys. We, 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 just, we have a lot of fun together. What do you do in your free time? Do you go to the spa or do you like... I saw you in a picture taking... I saw you in a, photo, in a photograph with a camera, like as if that might have been a second hobby. What does Janet Jackson do to unwind? I don't have any hobbies, really. That's, that's Jermaine's hobby. He loves 
photography a great deal. Um, I just like being with my friends, being with my family. I love going to clubs, relaxing. I, I like the movies. I like stuff like that. I love amusement parks. You know, we're talking to Janet Jackson. Now, what about the rumor that the Jackson 5 is doing this whole reunion tour next year and that you might be part of it? Is that true? Are we going to get a tour? Well, I've, I've been working very hard at trying to make it happen. It's, it's not something that's happening right now. So, I don't know. You know, uh, they're very interested except for one. He's kind of on the fence, and I have to respect that. And hopefully he'll come around. Who is that? A lot of fans ask me about... It happening, and you know, just the impact that it would have on the entire world would be incredible. And it's not—it's—it's—it's it's, it's a no-brainer. It really is. And I've never opened for anyone, so I thought it would be a, a an interesting little journey for the evening for people. Wow! Is it Michael who's being difficult? I can't say difficult. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's a good word. But that's what you're um, referring to. It, it is, Mike, but I have to respect the fact that he's worked very hard in his solo career, and he he's still into that. So you, you have to respect that. And, you know, like I said, hopefully he will come around. We're talking to Janet but, Jackson, for those of you just tuning in. Go ahead, I'm sorry. I listen to you in the morning when I'm at home. Lord, and you still call. We <laughs> appreciate that. Thank you. I do. I, do. I, I enjoy listening to you. Thank I just you. have to tell you that. Thank you. You know, they told me to take it easy, and I'm trying to embrace our black music royalty. So I do want to know, however, is it possible for you guys, the Jacksons, to ever run out of money? Anybody can. Anyone can. Do you like live like that? Like, do you have enough? Like, how much are you? How much money you got? <laughs> I don't talk about that. I don't. I don't really think that's anyone's business. I really, I really don't. But people, people are very intrigued by that. I don't talk about stuff like that. All right. Well, can I ask you something else? And please, please don't get mad at me. Well, it all depends upon what it is. I can't say I can't get mad at you. No, I don't want you to get mad. I just have to ask because of the Well, then don't, then don't ask me if you think I'm going to get mad at you. How's that? <laughs> <laughs> all right, Michael, Sean, you ask. There are rumors. There are rumors that there's a child that you had way back that was raised by your sister, Rebe. Y'all oh, are true. so messy. Why do y'all have to be so I, We have to because they're going to they're gonna kill Jones How right now. How many times do I have to tell everyone no? I've never had a child. See, so we don't have to ask anymore. I've, I've, I've never had a child. I would never, ever have a child and never allow a child to not know who their father is. And Ms. Jackson, I I've believe this, you. But those trifling ass the barge people keep saying it and they keep bringing a rumor up and they want to... Said no. they were, I'm just saying, why do the barges keep saying that? Yeah. Like it's a I have no clue. I don't know if they want to bring more attention to themselves for a project that they're embarking on. I don't know. But I... Please believe me. I do not have a child. I I've never had a leave child. Leave alone now. I believe you. Okay. I'm just asking because it's Pete. I could care less. Now, this is my last question for me. I have a younger sister, and I know I've been through some stuff where she's been worried about me. Have you ever been really worried about Michael and all the stuff that he's going through now and all the so-called rumors and the plastic surgeries and the sickness and everything like that? I don't that? talk about my brother anymore, so I'm not going to answer that question. Mm. Oh, okay. okay. We respect her. No are, worries. Are you, excited? are you excited about the upcoming tour? I really am. I, I, I really am. Are, have things changed that much in the music industry since, I guess, the last time you've done a really big tour? The, the industry has made a, a, a huge change, but I don't think it, there's been that much of a change touring other than, you know, it's, 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 it's not as strong as it was back in the day, but everything is cyclical. I, you know, it's, it's happened with the film industry where it was in a slump for a minute and then it came out of it. And last year it had its biggest year. It made like, what was it, 70 Seventy-two billion dollars or seventy-six mm -hmm. billion dollars uh, in films this past year, which was the biggest ever. Right. Will you so be doing it, more it, movies? I'm sorry. Will you be doing more movies? Yes, I definitely will. I, I actually wanted to do one before I started promoting this album, but unfortunately, uh, the, the strike happened, so I went straight into the promotion aspect of 
of the album, and, and hopefully I'll wind up doing another one, if I can fit it in, before we start the, the tour. And which do you prefer? If you, ca if you had your way and you could just do movies for the rest of your life, would you do that? Or would you always like to be um, involved in music? I would do both, because music has always been my life, and music moves me. And even before I, I had a record deal, music has always moved me. I used to write songs when I was a kid. I've been writing music since I was nine years old. So it's, it's, a, it's a strong part of my life, even though acting was my, my first love, my first passion. I would have to do both. Now we're talking, can you, to, we're talking to Janet Jackson. Can you sing a little bit of Young Love? Oh my God! I haven't sang that song since I was a kid. I know. Come on. No, no. If you want, if you want a concert, you gotta pay for a ticket. Oh, <laughs> oh all right, all right. Oh. Now, Janet, the the album is called Discipline. Now, yeah. and the album is it about your life, or is it about sex, or is it about music? Discipline. I always write about my life experiences, and and it relates to my life in some sort of way. I can't sing it if I haven't experienced it, or if there's uh, not a connection there has to be a connection is there anyone out there that you listen to in your iPod any of any favorites of yours I love Alicia I love Alicia Keys as of right now the, the, the kids coming up I love Alicia Keys I I think she's incredibly talented but what really drives me to her is she is just a beautiful soul she has such a wonderful heart and always has always been very, very kind, very, very genuine, and I love that she has not changed, not one bit. Ladies and gentlemen, Janet Jackson, nice. thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. We wish you well, and we can't wait for you to come to town and put it down on the stage. And um, please try and stop by in person when you do get to town. Thank you very much. <laughs>